BCAAs or protein? Which is better for building lean muscle? And are you missing out on muscle growth if you aren't taking one or the other? So let's quickly review the basics of amino acids. There are over 80 different amino acids, but our bodies use only 20. Out of those 20, there are 11 that are non-essential aminos. Now, don't think that means they're not important. It just means that you do not need to supplement with them because your body makes them on its own. The remaining nine are essential aminos, meaning you need to get them through food or supplementation. Now, out of these essential aminos, three play an important role in post-workout recovery and lean muscle building. Leucine, isoleucine, and valine. These three are called branch chain amino acids, more commonly referred to as BCAAs. Now, BCAAs are key amino acids for modulating muscle protein metabolism, leading to an increase in muscle protein anabolism. Simply put, our bodies use energy to build cells, anabolism, or break cells down to create energy, catabolism. Now, when building muscle, anabolism is good and catabolism is generally not. Now, unlike most aminos that are metabolized in the liver, BCAAs are metabolized primarily in the skeletal muscle, which means your body's able to break them down quickly for fuel. So in short, BCAAs are readily utilized by the body and necessary for building and repairing muscle. They can also be beneficial for someone looking to lose weight without sacrificing hard-earned muscle. Restricting calories can put your body in a catabolic state where it begins to break down lean muscle as a source of energy instead of fat stores. Supplementing with BCAs can help reduce this unwanted muscle breakdown. Now, one of the easiest ways to get BCAs is through a BCA supplement. Now, most are available in an easy to take powder form that you just mix with water. You can get them in all sorts of great fruit flavors that taste amazing. You can also get BCAs through food sources as well, like chicken, meat, fish, eggs, and dairy, which are all good sources of protein. And where you find protein, you find BCAs. So yes, in a protein powder too. So now, if you can get BCAs in your protein powder, then why would you take a separate BCA supplement? Well, the answer is in the speed at which your body is able to utilize those specific aminos. For this to make sense, let's quickly break down what protein is. Now, protein is made up of amino acids bonded together with peptides to form long chains. Now, imagine peptides being the glue that holds them all together. In order for you to utilize those individual amino acids, your body first has to break apart those bonds. So although you're getting your BCAs and your protein, those aminos aren't as readily available for fuel as they would be in a standalone BCA supplement. BCA supplements contain L-leucine, L-isoleucine, and L-valine in their free form, meaning the amino acid is in its individual form and not bonded to any other aminos. A step in between long protein chains of aminos and individual free form aminos are peptides, which are shorter chains of aminos. And it's been found that peptides are more easily and efficiently absorbed than free form aminos. So taking your three branch chain amino acids and bonding them to create oligopeptides, such as in BPI Sports Best BCA, helps maximize the absorption and body's utilization. So now we know what the benefit of a BCA is, but then why take a protein powder? Well, BCAs only give you three out of the nine essential amino acids. A high quality whey supplement will give you all nine, which all play a critical role in building muscle and maintaining health. In other words, you're getting a more complete amino acid profile with a real whey supplement. Now, I have to preface it by saying real because there are a lot of protein supplements that aren't necessarily real. Now, if you've heard of protein spiking or amino spiking, you'll know what I mean. As you know, proteins are comprised of chains of amino acids bonded together. Now, if you were to do a lab test on a real protein supplement, you'd find a specific ratio of each of the nine essential amino acids. 
if you conducted that same test but found higher amounts of certain free form amino acids, then beware, that supplement is not real. The key here is free form aminos because complete proteins are peptide bonded together. So the question is, why would there be free form amino acids in a protein supplement? And the answer is nitrogen content. The most basic protein tests only check for nitrogen content. Now proteins are high in nitrogen, so here's where some bad supplement companies get real sneaky. High quality raw weight is expensive, whereas there are a few cheap free form amino acids that are exceptionally high in nitrogen. So here's the trick. Cut back the amount of expensive protein and put in a few cheap amino acids in there to trick the nitrogen test. Pretty dishonest, right? This is why third party verification testing is important to make sure you're getting the highest quality supplement. Make sure to look for a protein that has a separate company conduct ongoing testing and auditing. That way you don't have to take the supplement company's word for it. So now that we've covered the reason to take a BCA versus a protein supplement, which one wins the ultimate battle for muscle building supremacy? Well, I hate to tell you, but the answer is both, but in different ways. This is why I include both in my daily nutrition and supplement regimen. Because peptides are better absorbed and utilized in free form amino acids, I use a peptide linked BCA supplement. With the same reasoning, I use a protein powder with a high amount of whey hydrolysis. Now a whey hydrolysis has gone through an extra process to help break apart some of those amino acid bonds, making smaller peptide chains, which helps increase the ease and speed of digestion. I take my BCAs right before my workout and a whey hydrolysis rich protein powder right after. Now it's the best of both worlds for a complete approach to building lean muscle.